I'm not going to say nothing, but I was reading this morning, David, the Bible said that we're ambassadors for Christ. And you know what an ambassador is? It's somebody with power, you know? It's somebody with power. The president's got an ambassador that when he can't go places, he sends out the ambassador. He gave him. He's got just as much power as the president does, you know? And I got to thinking, you know, God is... We're, we're, we're ambassadors for Christ's sake, the Bible yeah. says. We're all soldiers in the army of the Lord. Right. You know, we're, you believe that or not, we're all soldiers in the army of God. We all have power with God. I don't have no more power than you do. You don't have no more, no more power than somebody else does. Right. We all are equal in the eyes of God. Oh. You know, and I've got to thinking, you know, uh, David, you know, a lot of times... Uh, uh, we want God to do this and do that for us and give us this and give us that. And we won't even use what God has already given us. And we expect God to give us more. I'm going to tell you, God ain't going to give you no more than what you got until you use what you got. You know, that's not believe And we're ambassadors for Christ. We have power over the devil. The Bible says this. God said, Behold, I give you power over the power of the enemy to tread upon serpents and scorpions and, and over some of the devil. No, he said, Over all the power of the enemy. Church, we have power with God. And I began to think, you know, I thought, you know, how many times to, uh, that, that, that people need things and they won't even use what they got. It's just like this. If you're walking every day, everywhere you go, and uh, uh, somebody brings you a car and says, Here, here's the key. He's telling you got a full tank of gas. Right. And this thing is still walking. We're still here walking in the center. Come on. We need somebody to shake us up. You know? yeah. And I tell you, church, tonight, I refuse uh, to sit in the house of God and fly up uh, and go to heaven because God says, uh, I give you power over all the power yeah. of the enemy. And God has given us all something to do. Uh, he's given us all something that we can use. You will work. Uh, you want to know what it is? It's in your word of God. Pick it up and begin to read it uh, and you'll see how much power you have. Side. But you know what God said, Moses, oh, what you got in your hand? And you know what he done? He spread it out over the sea. Oh, what's the rod in the sea? The fire. But God has given us all something. But you know what we do? We'll sit back and let the devil take everything that God has given us. He called us out here tonight to praise him. But you know what the devil will tell me? One of us. But the devil in this building now is set down. God do nothing for God. Church, when the wind was chanting, was up against the Philistines, and they're laying an old job on him and ass. But you know what God told him to do? I pick it up, Samson, I use that for a tool. I just said to look at him and say, No, that ain't gonna do me no good, no, sir. He picked that thing up, brother Sam, and he began to use that. He did a bad devil, church, and God has given you something to use against the devil. I don't know about you, but I didn't come out here to look at one another. I didn't come out here to see who I could see. I didn't come out here with God on my mind. I didn't to help me, church. And the day that we live and they get my same will. I'm preaching what's wrong. I tell you, they devils out to our church. If you don't use what you got, he's going to take it away from you. But I do know one thing. We all need Jesus. Oh, God, need Him in this Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I, I begin to think, you know, how there's so many people are messed up. If we can get them to Jesus, yeah. they got everything to take with me. If we can get them to God, Brother Sam, He'll take care of the rest. Yes. You know what we want to do? We want to put them down and cast them out. I say they're no good. A church that they fly up in, that they break them. 
and they saw yeah. more of my tell you yeah. and God is coming back after our people that's made they're still praying Amen. he's coming back after our church I don't know about you but I want to praise God don't you I want to move of God in my life I read about it in the book of Acts and how to I didn't read where he said I'm the same yesterday and forevermore if God done it back in he's able to do it today but you know where it's at it's in me I'm not looking at you I'm looking at me I want to go higher don't you I'm excited about Jesus Christ I've been saved and redeemed by the blood of Jesus and the devil's come too late to tell me that I don't have something with God I may not jump over the pews every time that I hit my knees and pray I may not speak in tongues I may not feel a chill pop but one thing about it, I know that I got God give him no credit for nothing. You know what he wants? He wants you to praise him. But when we can praise God after coming through hell all day and God to look at that saying, that's my child. I'm going to bless him just a little bit more. If you fall the pattern of hell today, praise God. Tell him you love him. Let the devil know that you're not defeated. I'm not going to roll over and let him have what God gave me. No, sir, I come out here to praise God. I love every one of you in here. I want to see everybody get excited and happy about God. A church yes. somebody comes in that we don't know. But we want them to leave excited. But we don't want them to leave and say, why? That's a dead church. Oh. Oh. If anything dead, you know what it needs? It needs to talk out Murray, Brother Sam. Yes. And that was alive every man. But we want to be caught up to be with the Lord. Yes. God's coming back for our church. And he's coming back for a live church. Yes. He's not coming after a dead church. You know, sir, he ain't. He's coming after a church uh, that's made herself yes, baby. And tell the man it's some hell uh, that I'm going to push through. Uh, and there's some devils I'm going to walk over top of uh, to get the broke through that I need. Uh, we all need a broke through. You need Christ. Uh, uh, Brother David, we need uh, God to rain down on us. Uh, but we don't want to do what he says and use what he gives us. Uh, we want somebody else to drag us in. We want yeah. another preacher man to drag us into the anointing uh, uh, to get us where we can praise God. Uh, I tell you, I thank God for every preacher they are. Uh, uh, that's anointed, but you know what? Uh, uh, they sometimes that we got to get up and do something. Uh, uh, they sometimes that we got to get up and say, Devil, uh, I've had enough. Uh, uh, when you get sick and tired of the devil uh, uh, keeping you down, uh, uh, you're going to come out of our swing. Uh, I'm glad to be here tonight. It's you. I'm glad to be here. I praise you. We got power with God. God said, I give you power to tread over serpent and scorpion over all the power of the enemy. Yes. We have power with God. If the devil's a buff with you, pick up the word of God and begin to use it on yes. the yes. He will flee from you. Yes. But if you just put that thing right there and say, devil, get away from me, that ain't going to do you a bit of good. And then when you begin to decline the word of God on him, he's got to go, I guarantee you. Go. But we want to rub him on the back and push him over there. He's going to be right back in the next minute. Sometimes we got to get violent with the devil. Yes. Yeah. We got to haul off sometime to kick him right upside the head, Brother Sam. I tell you what, if things are biting dog to hold you, you ain't going to reach down and pit him and say, Get over there and lay down. Uh -huh. I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to come from the bottom and get you. Come on. Everybody do something, Sister Liz. I'm happy about Jesus. I know where he brought me from. I know where he brought me from. And I know where I'm going. I may have to fight the power of hell every day. But as long as I got one foot in front of the other, knowing I'm going forward, I'm going somewhere with God. It's you. I did come down here, Brother David, just to look around. But I come to praise God, church. We're blessed. We're a blessed people to be in the building now with the Spirit of God. Yes. We are very blessed. Just don't let the devil cause us not to do nothing for God.